Well, yeah, thanks for joining me again. All right, let's walk through some more Fallout 4. And we last left off at the Four Leaf Fish Packing Plant. Uh, we did the um, Diamond City Blues mission, and we got a whack ton of drugs. I took the liberty of coming to Sanctuary and getting organized for this next right. mission. This, we are going to explore the Hallucid... I have problems saying this word. Then I looked it up in Google and realized it's not even a word. If you, like, Google this word, Hallucigen... All the all you get is Fallout 4 results. It's actually hallucinogen. That's why I have problems saying this word. Hallucigen. Hallucigen Inc. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go there and uh, we're gonna keep with the theme of drugs and we're gonna go through the Hallucigen Inc. building, which is just south of the Charles View Amphitheater. We're gonna go there and go through the entire building, get down to the lab in the basement and lay ourselves, lay our hands on some hallucigen ink canisters which can be crafted into hallucigen gas bombs or gas grenades and when you throw those um everyone goes apeshit it's absolutely a riot you must have some of these uh, if you want to see these in effect check out my uh five suicidal stunts you must do and follow for or you haven't lived video that's over on my other channel major slack videos i'll put a link to that in the video description yeah uh, hallucigen gas grenades causes everybody to go ape shit, makes them frenzy. So that's what we're gonna do. Uh, and uh, all you need for this is your weaponry, of course, and you need your business suit, some great men tats, and a beer. That's it. Let's get going. Let's start off by going to Good Neighbor because there's a quest associated with this location we can do to earn 400 XP. Good neighbor, where are you? Good neighbor, good neighbor, good neighbor, good neighbor, good neighbor. Hello, good neighbor. Right here, Slack. Oh, there you are. Okay, there we go. Now, some things I want to talk about. Plans for this walkthrough, I guess we're like, we're 150 episodes in, and I guess a lot of you are wondering, where are you going with this, Slack? Um, I'm going to do this, Hallucigen Inc., and I'm going to do another mission that you're going to see that I'll take on when we get to Good Neighbor uh, involving the Shamrock Tap House and then I'm going to choose a faction and push through to the end of the game all right and I may do all the endings depending on how much um, everybody's interested in that but of course I'm gonna do one ending and what ending am I gonna choose you just have to wait and see now for now we're going to Hotel Rexford all right like Sammy too. Sure as hell didn't act. Alright, in Hotel Rexford, you're looking for this guy right there, Fred. And before you talk to Fred, put on your business suit, black ring glasses, original suit, armored newsboy cap, and let's chomp, chomp on some great men tats and guzzle back. Whoop, shit, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> Whoopsie daisy. Uh, we're going to have to talk to Fred in slow motion. I wonder if the hell this is going to work. <laughs> Alright, Fred. I'm a little stone right now, but I think I could use some more. This is hilarious. Okay, uh, let me just back off here and wait till this wears off. Okay. Excuse me. I am so happy to see you again. I got all kinds of candy if you're interested. Okay, now just to be clear, I've never seen Fred before in my life. You know, I do not do I do not do business with Fred. I am not a drug addict. Okay, <clears throat> that's my story, and I'm sticking to it. And uh, when you talk to Fred, ask him looking for work. You have any work? Yeah, actually, you might be perfect. You know the Gunners, right? The high-end mercenaries. Well, a few of them were talking about scavenging around that old hallucinogen building. I mean, just. Think about that name. There's got to be some shit there that's out of this world. You get me something, I pay you 200 caps. Okay, now you can ask him for more money. Your offer is a little low, Fred. All right, let's make if it If your charisma is really high. That's why I said put on your business suit. Let's ask him for more money. Not good enough. You said there's already a crew of mercs there. I did say that, didn't I? How about 300? How about a little more? Good neighbors full of chem addicts. You have plenty of money to fund this job. Okay, okay. You got me. 400 caps, that's all I can put out. All right, gunners? You said there were gunners out there? The blackest hearted mercs around, friend. Well armed, organized. So, you know, 
Make sure they don't catch you. All right, Fred. We have a deal. You're the best. The absolute best. Okay, a little stealth burp there. Um, <laughs> in case of those of you who are listening with your headphones on. Uh, now, let's ask Rufus for some work as well. We can earn some more XP. Is that Rufus? Hey there. That's Rufus. You're okay, good hang on. I think my beer is in. My beer's gonna run out because I screwed up. He's taking the jet. Take another beer. I'm Here we go. Mistaken. What do you think of the place? And how about why? Why do you ask? Just trying to get a feel for you. Ain't exactly the safest neighborhood, so I like to know who's gonna cause trouble and who's gonna end it. Name's Rufus. I do repairs around here. Keep the robots running. Sell a bit of scrap. That sort of thing. I'm usually here or drinking that swill Charlie slinging at the third rail. Looking for parts? I also might have a job for you if you're interested. County Crossing is no longer allied with me. Okay, that's nice. I'll work on that later. Uh, what's the job? What's the job? Don't know if you've had the beer down at the third rail, but I swear Charlie must have found it in a sewer. Found this hollow tape while doing repairs at the Rexford. Delivery notice for a brewing machine. Pre-war. Thing is, it was never delivered. Well, with all the bombs and all. Done some asking around, and I think it might still be intact. Which is where you come in. Okay, and once again, let's ask for more money and get more XP. I assume this is a paying job. Of course. How about 200 caps and some of the beer? Think you can get a hold of that brewing machine for me? This isn't exactly the safest neighborhood. What about hazard pay? Fair point. 300 caps plus beer. Are you going to take the job? And let's take advantage of our great Mentats and ask for even more money. Have you seen how many super mutants are out there? You drive a hard bargain. 400 caps plus beer. But that's all I can do. Think you can get a hold of that brewing machine for me? All right, we're in. I'm in. Let's do it. Great. So, the brewing machine is in the basement of an old bar called the Shamrock Tap House. Shamrock Tap House. There we go. When you leave town, make your way around east till you hit Atlantic. Great big grain sign. Bring it back here when you're done. Done and done. So there you go. A whole bunch of XP just for talking to a couple guys. Talking to a couple guys, rather, at Hotel Rexford. Let's go do the first mission. Hallucigen Inc. Alright, Hallucigen Inc. As I said earlier, is just south of the Charles View Amphitheater, which we went when we were doing the Secret of the Cabot House mission earlier on. So, fast travel there. Survival mode beta. Survival mode beta is out. I thought they forgot all about this. I thought they were gonna like, you know, just not do it, but they did it. Bethesda has released survival mode beta on Steam, okay? This is great. PC gamers are actually getting something before console gamers. Nothing personal, okay? But we always get the short end of the stick, okay? We're always like last on the list. Oh yeah, you PC gamers. Okay, here's a bone, you know, five years later, you know? But yeah, we actually get it first. Ha ha, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. No, but that came out on Tuesday. Tuesday, March 29th, um, Bethesda released the new kick-ass, freaking hardcore survival mode. This survival mode has no fast travel, uh, no saving, um, all kinds of survival elements that you have to deal with, like hunger, thirst, disease, it, it's nuts. And I am going to do a walkthrough of that. I'm gonna start a walkthrough of that, hopefully, today but at the very latest tomorrow on my other channel major slack videos okay so look forward to that that's what i've been doing lately i know i got i promised you guys a walkthrough of uh i don't have my armor on yeah i know i promised you guys a walkthrough of automatron this is what's going to happen i'm going to um do a walkthrough of uh the new survival survival mode beta I want to call it beta. I don't know why. It's beta. I looked this up, okay? I actually looked up how to pronounce the word. Hey, how about that, eh? <laughs> yeah, yeah, beta. And then I'm going to run through Act 1, and that'll push me up around maybe level... close to level 20. Once I get to level 20, then I'll do a walkthrough of the Automatron DLC on survival. Yeah. Beta. Yeah, that's going to be nuts. Absolutely nuts. So that's the plan over on Major Slack videos, all right? And I'm going to be using a completely different build. Alright, Hallucigen Inc. Everybody here is stoned out of their gourds, okay? So they're mostly going to be fighting each other. 
did you survive? You did, you got this little smidgen of health left. Uh, I'll tell you what, let's take some psycho. This place is an absolute labyrinth, all right? We got a legendary up there. That just pissed him off, let's take another shot. Down you go. Something else I forgot to tell you. I did do some cooking. I cooked up some drugs back in Sanctuary and I made a whole bunch of these glowing blood packs which are affected by anything that lengthens the time that your drugs Repeat. last. A chemical For example, the protected. chemist perk. The this strange one, strangely enough, is affected by that. So normally I think this only restores uh, 30 or 40% of your health, but if you have like the chemist perk or any other perks that uh, uh, lengthen the time that drugs last. This will actually increase. I've seen this gone go as high as 100%. So that's my um, my emergency eatables, if you will. All right, so let's get going. Pushing east down here. Most everybody's going to be distracted, fighting amongst themselves. So there should be easy shots. Once again, we're after hallucinogen. <laughs> canisters which are in the basement all right there's nine of them in the basement and these can be crafted into hallucinogen gas grenades Where? okay let me just focus on gaming here this is where we're going that's where we were right there okay you have to go down and around to get up here repeat a chemical leak has been detected please evacuate the building And hmm, this is actually not bad. <laughs> this, is, this is funny. This is hilarious. I love this shit. Nice one! Awesome! Awesome! How you doing there? Oh, no, 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 no. I don't think so. You get a time out. You look a little cranky. There we go, time out. Okay, and now in this room, what you can do is kind of like set a little booby trap here. This is kind of like a, a Tesla coil, if you will. You know, you can set this up by hacking this terminal here. All right, hacking it up here, boss. Let me just copy down all the words. All right, here we go. First word, paper. Has a likeness of two. Looks like Gates is the only one that it could possibly be. Bingo, there we go. Alright, activate current prototype. That's the one you want. Now you will get zapped a little bit. <laughs> this is kind of like. A <laughs> Stand back. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, but don't die, don't die. <laughs> yeah, this is kind of like, you know, one of those Three Stooges kind of thing, you know. Hey. Mm, wise guy, eh? Yuck, yuck, yuck. Uh, where is my the glowing blood pack there? I do have it. Please evacuate the building immediately. Okay, shields up, Scotty. Let's see if we can zap somebody with this for what it's worth. It is reusable, all right? So go in here. Who's there? Lock tight. Ah, oh, dang it. We wanted to use you for an experiment. Okay. Anybody here? Oh, this guy died. Damn it. I went through all that trouble for nothing. Whoops. Anybody here? Alright, so if you play this and there's people still surviving, what you can do is uh, take a pot shot at them. Go running back in here. Hit up the terminal again. Hit activate current prototype and that'll set off your little Tesla coil and the guy will get zapped, you know, just if you want some cheap thrills. <laughs> okay. That was a plan. Onward and upward. 
Let me just get sneaky again. Oh, my bye, bye, guys. Where were you? Hang on. Okay, here we go. This way. Atta boy. Walk this way. Okay, I'm gonna die just trying to get a cheap thrill here. <laughs> Don't always seem to go. He doesn't want to play ball. Okay, down you go. Quit chewing up my health. Got some plans for that health. As in, I need it. Awesome. This is neat. What's this? I'm always a sucker for any weapon with a long convoluted name. Recoil compensated powerful combat shotgun. I mean, it could be totally useless, but I, I gotta have it. It's a recoil compensated blah 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 combat shotgun. That's gotta be good for sure. A chemical leak has been detected. Please Actually, evacuate this is, uh, the building. There we go. Hi there, buddy. Ha <laughs> ha! <laughs> okay, uh... Just weapons... ...and ammo. Okay, if you see the buy or eye protection poster, you're going the right way. Come into this room, you see a whole bunch of button doorways. The one to continue is the one that's open. You can open these other button doorways to kind of like kill these guys and get some extra XP if you want. Atta boy. Keep your left up. Guard your grill. <laughs> Swing and a miss. Finally! Okay, that's enough out of you guys. A little bit for you, and a little bit for you. Boya. Boya base. Down you go, get some XP there. I didn't want that. This is Looney Tunes here, eh? <laughs> oh, hold up here! Hold. What just where do you think you're going? You all by your lonesome? Get some special treatment from down you go. Booyah base, yeah. There's another weapon with a long name. Let it oh no. Sorry. That's armor. I don't need that. Actually I should take the combat rifle for ammo. <laughs> Hurry. Here's a good one. This is hilarious. I just love this shit. <laughs> okay, that's enough out of you guys. Uh, we got to see a man about a horse. One down. Head popping goodness. Check it out. Over here. amazing I'm getting sneak attack damage from this range and I have leveled up that's great that's what I expected um, Please speaking of drugs we're gonna keep on the same three same theme rather and get chemist three any chems you take now last an additional 150 percent to longer yeah we want that we definitely want that here we go so the way to continue is the doorway that has the inactive button the button that's not functioning down this way Go up the ramp. Yeah, this is a total labyrinth. Up the stairs here. Welcome to the Hallucigen Labs observation area. Please step up to the windows for a demonstration of our products and development. And you can enjoy this demonstration if you have the advanced hacker perk. And then push all these buttons here and have a little show. I'm presuming I've never had I've never tried that before. I'm presuming that's what happens. Mm. The rest of you Please. follow me. What's your story? We'll take your bottle caps. And then we're gonna take these stairs all the way to the basement. I'll show you on the map where I am, just for posterity. Interior map. Okay, so we're in the southwest corner of the of the facility. <laughs> 